Yo, what up YouTube, what up boxing fans? Shout out to BoxingSocialist.com Kevin Davis, uh, you know, and Sean Craddock, both of those guys put together an excellent webpage that I personally brought, uh, built up my YouTube in the beginning on Boxing Socialist, so I owe them a lot and uh, they constantly put out quality blogs and videos. Topic of today, the game plan for Canelo Alvarez and it seems like he's really taking a page out of Oscar De La Hoya's approach to beating Floyd Mayweather. Why? Well because apparently De La Hoya just can't shut up about how he knows how to beat Floyd Mayweather. So uh, you know I'm referring to this blog written by Kevin Davis which pretty much reveals that it seems like the Canelo camp uh, has leaked their game plan and it's pretty simple um, so I'm reading from the blog it's to give away the first round to gauge and study distance find the range and then the next round bring the pressure Oscar De La Hoya wants Canelo to use the jab and his activity Canelo um, is trying to mimic what De La Hoya did by punching, uh, by punching Mayweather on the shoulders, on the arms, wherever he can. You know, just flurrying. It doesn't matter if it lands, but he just wants to get Floyd's attention, and he wants to get him into uh, get in into a a zone where he's at the right distance, where they're basically trading shots while Canelo is um, flurrying, you know, quickly throwing quick combinations and uh, going back to the jab, right? However, can, can, I, can Canelo keep up his pace? You know, the pace De La Hoya uh, tried to implement was too fast for him. And like it or not, however many excuses De La Hoya is going to give you on why he lost that fight, he simply ran out of gas. He just did not have the energy in the later rounds to keep doing what he was doing in the early rounds because Mayweather simply you know led him down this path of throwing shots and throwing shots and having it land on his arms and elbows to where Mayweather hadn't lost any energy and he would simply counter shot him to death in 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 the latter half of that fight it was um, very very sad to see De La Hoya with Mayweather in front of him whooping his ass landing clean shot after clean shot after clean shot and De La Hoya just couldn't do anything about it because he did not have the energy to lift his hands up you know move his body and try and bully De La, uh, sorry bully Floyd Mayweather to the ropes so apparently uh, Oscar De La Hoya is is having Canelo try and repeat the same mistakes he he made. Oscar ag agrees uh, that he's got to keep up the jab, something that he didn't do. However, he's got to tell Canelo, don't tire yourself out. Don't, you know, don't get too excited trying to win rounds and flurrying or flurrying while Mayweather uh, isn't taking any damage. You know, he's got to. He's got to throw his flurry and back up, not get too excited and throw a bunch of shots uh, that are all missing, right? Um, Canelo believes people uh, think that you can't outbox Floyd, but this is the kind of approach that Canelo wants to try and take. Uh, he wants to beat Mayweather at his own game. So, you know, that's what it is. Uh, leaked information exclusively on Boxing Socialist. It, it's definitely worth a visit on a daily basis. And, you know, shout out to Carcino. Uh, for now, it is what it is, guys. Do you guys think Canelo will have a plan B and C if he tires himself out? That's a recipe for disaster, in my opinion. So, let me know what you guys think. How is he not going to tire himself out 
if he fights the way Delahoya did. Peace out, take care.